Synchronized, baby. Woo! Unlocking the power of Forley. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to more Steven Plays Assassin's Creed 2. I was wondering where that Assassin's Tomb was. I said that I thought it was in Forley, and I was right. Uh, apparently, we hadn't looked around in Forley too much. There's a lot of... We haven't really bothered to explore here at all, which is kind of sad. There's a lot of stuff worth seeing here. There's a lot of viewpoints. There's codex pages. Um, I'm most interested in the Assassin's Tomb because I'd really like to proceed with getting um, the rest of the seals, a.k.a. <laughs> one, and um, getting the Altair armor. So that's the goal today. The goal is to finish the Assassin Tomb, retor return to the villa, and turn in our seals so we can get the armor and see what happens. Get out of my way. Forley! Hooray! Oh, look! Also, fastest way to get rid of these guys? No, please! I am Run into them. You don't get in trouble, from what I can tell. They drop their instruments, and you don't have to kill them. It really works out good for you and them, because they don't die, and you don't get in trouble for making them die. As far as I'm concerned, that is a win-win situation. Roca di Ralvandino. So let's wander in here aimlessly. I don't know if I'm allowed to be in here or not. I think I'm good. Hello, fellas. Hope you're having a wonderful day. I'm just going to peek my head over this corner here. Because it looks like where I need to be is over here. Whoop. And is it on the other side here? Looks like it's just a little drop down here. On the middle of this nowhere. Interact. Here we are, folks. Trying to get the last of the seals. I have to admit, quite frankly, I'm pumped. Another wonderful place. Has there ever been a nice... Well, okay, I take it back. There has been a few nice Assassin Tomb ones, but a lot of them are just dark and dingy and then... Crap. All right, uh, infiltrate Roca di Ralvandino and find the assassin seal hidden within. I accept. This is a restricted area, meaning we are going to be running into guards. I like it like that. I prefer that, I think. Um, we did the last one. I think we did last episode, and we did it really, really quickly. So no, no, uh, no qualms there. Let's turn around. Woo! This is probably going to be super difficult. If we stay focused, we'll do it. Although the one last, the one last step, the last uh, assassin tomb was actually pretty friggin' hard. Um, the last few have been very difficult. All right, so this is another timed thing. And I have a contextual camera that will show that me the other side, my other shoulder. Um, don't know where I'm going, but I get. What what was that for? Just so I could get into this room? Seems odd. All right, woo. Okay, let's just chill here for a second. Tried to get our bearings. Where are we going? We're probably trying to get up there. Um, it's kind of odd. It looks like might be able to climb up there or something. I'm not really sure. Oh, wait. Hold on. Can we get on this little island? No. Uh, there's a post we can climb. So, apparently, wherever we need to go is right in front of us. Oh, my God. All I had to do was come over to the gate and swim under it. Have we been able to swim under things before, or ha have they used that mechanic at all? That's I'm assuming that's why I was so confused about what to do there. I was just, like, looking around the room like, why is this so difficult? And it wasn't. It's just that <laughs> they suddenly were like, oh, hey, uh, did you know you can swim under stuff? Because you can, and that's what you're supposed to do. Woo! This is kind of fun. I enjoy this. There we go, up and around. There's a tiny little bit of light coming through. It's a nice touch. Now we continue to make our way around the outside of the room, and it looks like we have a friend. Now we're into the fun part. Now we have to do a lot of jumping and running and moving around while simultaneously either avoiding or killing the guards, although there are a lot of guards. Let's get rid of this guy. It doesn't hurt to assassinate them because uh, we're already super notorious. The problem here is, even if we attempt to be... Um, stealthy. There are so many guys here that we're probably eventually going to run into a problem. Like the fact that some guy up there s magically sees me. And I'm not sure how they magically see me, but they somehow magically see me. And are, I guess, attempting to make their way over here to see me for sure. I can't see him anymore! 
Climb the ladder, honey. Gotcha. Did that kill him? Can I assassin? Okay. <laughs> and release. All right, so so much for that. Let's jump over to this side of the room. There's no one over here. There's no one over here. Not a soul. Was he not just there? I thought I saw something. Oh God, my innards! No, I think I just tasted my small intestine. That guy's dead. So there's only two left. That's not really. Bad. <laughs> it's not really that bad. Uh. Let's see. I guess we actually just walk around this way. Oh no no no! That's a door. That's a giant door. Um, and we need to get a. Actually, what we need to do is get up there. In fact, if can I just? No, that sucks. We need to get up there because there's a uh, there's an opening there, and if we were on top of those beams, this would all be very very different. So we got to figure out how to get on top of the beams. Can I climb this? Yes. Is that how I do this? Um, yeah, quite possibly. Mm, might have to go this way. Oh, there's a dude chilling there. That dude's about to be my dude. Hey. Eccolo, you won't <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. He was like, hey, that guy is just kind of sitting there. That seems kind of problematic. That guy's dead. These are like the weakest dudes in the world. They should put more heavily armed guards here. Oh, I did the nipple attack. He's nippleless. Alright, so now that I'm over here, and there are literally no guards left to kill, should be able to find my way pretty easily. I must have made my way around that door. Uh, now there's a new door. So this is like a, a continued puzzle. So this is the door I was at before, but I can't open the door, which is upsetting. Um, can I grab this thing? Aha! Woo! I did it! You ain't so good, game. You gotta throw me something tougher. So there's two levers. I'm assuming this lever opens the way to get to the next lever, and then I have to hit the next lever and continue on my merry way, and it's all time, so I gotta hurry. So that opens up this. Woohoo! As fast as I can. And then let's hit this thing. If I can. That opens up the next one, which is, I believe, like, directly in front of me. There we go! Good show! And also, pretty easy. Um, maybe they'll get harder. Alright, so is this where I was bef- Okay, this is where I was before. So, I need to make sure I don't screw up whatever it is I'm supposed to be doing here. Looks like I need to go along this wall. This would probably be more interesting if there were guys left alive. Oh, there is a guy! There's a single dude over there. And, uh, I'm probably gonna go meet him in just a second. Let's drop down here. Whoop! Where you at, dude? Oh, there's a bunch of them, actually. Now what's the... And it looks like maybe they're bigger dudes? I'm not sure. Yeah, they got some bigger weapons, I think. There's a big guy! Alright, Axe Man. So we need to get up into that little alcove. No problem! Find the burial chamber. I can do that with ease. Start by getting up here. Don't let them see you. Oh god, no, 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 You heard nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. Hug the wall. Okay. We're good. We're good. Let's, uh... Is it possible to... Hello, friend. Assassinate! Killing all his friends. Take a shortcut up here. Is anyone else around? I think they're all on the bottom floor, so I, I might have just skipped some. Which is excellent, or maybe not. Maybe this is just not the way you go. <laughs> I thought I was clever, dang it. Apparently I'm not that clever. Uh, okay, well I'm going back down. Assassinate! Oh, crap, I, I missed it. Oh, there's a ladder. That's cool. He's like, I think I see him. Assassinate! Whee! That was not what was supposed to happen, because I hit a wall. That's two. The only guy left is the big dude. And I might be able to take him out without him knowing. Stealth, son. Stealth. Well, just gonna stand here and hold this axe. Maybe be alright if I walked this direction and looked at these barrels while I held old god. Huh. 
Larry's dead. That seems a little problematic. Oh, <laughs> death gargle. All right, so that's done. Now there are no one, uh, no one left in my way. I can get up there. I think I do that this way. Possibly? No. <laughs> oh, here we go. I remember the camera was like over here trying to show me some crap. There we go. Now we turn to the right. Oh God! I did not expect to grab something there. I'm really fortunate. I'm assuming that in playtesting, that wasn't there, and then everyone kept falling. And they're like, oh, maybe we should add a grabbable thing there. Alright, now I feel good. I'm not sure how much is left, but probably not a whole lot. There we go. This looks fancy. Oh, there's, we're still not there yet. Uh, we have to hit this thing, and then run around this stupid room to see if we can find the burial chamber. What's it do? I don't... I, I walked up this thing because I assumed that that was what I was supposed to do. I don't know what's happening. Um, this is clearly not correct. I need to be on top of the room. I have to get on top of those beams somehow. So I need to be up here. Oh, God! Did not... <laughs> I, I jumped into a wall and I'm assuming broke my skull. Let's try this one more time and see if I can get this on the first go. Because I was not... I uh, didn't really understand exactly where to go. I need to jump up here. Then I need to jump up here. There we go. That's better. Get up there. And then... Oh my god, Ezio. That's... You stupid son of a gun. Woo! Okay. Now, up this way. Turn around and jump. And pray a little bit. Aim for it. Go, go. And you're in, my friend. That feels good. All right, so uh, last time I missed out on a chest because up to this point they had always had three, and then apparently there was a fourth one in the last one, so I'm really going to double-check this room before I leave. Of course, I guess this will be the one room that has two. Got it. Uh, there's another thing over here. Let's go ahead and grab this. Seems good. And uh, that is if I wanted to leave the room. I'm not really sure why I'd want to leave. We're good! Holy crap, the sixth assassin seal is mine! Open that thing up, and... Oh crap, there's nothing in here but tofu! Suddenly a secret door appeared. Do 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 do! Exit using secret door, I think I will. Memory synced. That's six of six, baby. That is exciting. I'm always curious to see where it's gonna let us out. In the town of Forley, a town, uh, not really, we haven't really looked around in. Letting us out, uh, probably somewhat nearby. Seems good. There's a lot to Forley. Uh, I'm assuming that maybe it'll bring us over here later in the game. Maybe it's for later memory sequences. Like, there's, there's viewpoints and codex pages and all that crap. Oh my. Uh, in fact, there's a codex page right here. It'd be so silly not to just grab it. Um, excuse me. You work for me. Follow me. Thank you very much. No, stay um, back. Stop. And where... Wait, where is... Where is it? Here. Girls, distract them, please. Walk very... What are you doing? What are you... Hey. Hey. Girls, with the, with the balls. Did I tell them to distract them too? Now they seem very confused, like, what do we do? And they're all, they're all looking the wrong way. Up here, up here. Distract them. There we go, thank God. Alright, if you just do that, give me that solid... Appreciate it. Alright, let's run in here and grab this codex page. That was really weird. They kept looking the wrong way. I'm like, could you come up here on the west side? They're like, uh, what? What? We're just gonna stare at the gate. Okay, um, there's a million things that we could do here. There's a million viewpoints that we could do. There's a lot of uh, codex pages, and I do need to go through here and do all of the, uh, the viewpoints, of which there are a lot. Like, holy crap, there's a, there's a lot of them. But for right now, I'm actually going to go to the fast travel station, go back to the villa, and acquire the armor. Behind the secret bookshelf where impossible things can happen that the world's never seen before. In Uncle's Laboratory. Lives a place where you should place some seals so you can get sweet armor and do sweet kills. Alright, now the fun 
time of doing all of these one by one because I have never come down here. It actually, I'm pretty sure it would have been advantageous to come here beforehand and do all of this as I had collected them because I'm pretty sure that each seal gives you um, bonus money for the villa. So that was kind of stupid, but whatever. I'm excited. I'm just excited to get this armor. I'm kind of wondering if Uncle will love me more. <laughs> I mean, Cousin Mario. His name is Cousin Mario. There we go. That's four. And two more. And I'm wondering, is this just like... I don't know if the armor does anything special. I don't know anything about it. I'm assuming that it's just better. Like, it's just better than the crap that you can get. Um, and I just recently spent $75,000 on armor. But uh, I would have bought it anyway, even if I would have gotten this beforehand. Oh man, the gate! Oh snap. It's beautiful. Thank you, Altair, for this great gift. May it shield me from my enemies. Ho 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 ho! And now we are in... Altair's armor. I'm guessing. This is it? It's just... Is it dyed? Is that why it's this color? I'm assuming that's why. Let's take a look at our inventory. Armor. Uh, yeah, we're using all of our tier stuff, which is the best stuff in the game, and it's only slightly better than the stuff I already had on, so I must have had, I must have just bought nearly the best stuff in the game. Very cool. Very cool. And uh, apparently it can be dyed just like anything else, which is really neat. Um, it looks different with the, uh, with the black. Uh, I'm, I can't say it's good or bad, it's just very different. And also there's all of the values going up. Um, and actually, do I have more codex pages to put on here? I guess not. Or do I have to walk up to the thing? I have to walk up to the thing. Um, wow. We are only missing... We're only missing four. Holy crap. Okay. Uh, let me go ahead and grab the money. As if I, <laughs> as if I really need it. I have so much freaking money. I just got 50,000 bucks. And, uh, let's, uh... I'm gonna be honest. I kinda wanna go back to white now. I think I'm gonna run by the, uh, the fabric land... Um, and change my clothing to white. Okay, so I went to Assassin White, but my clothes are still black. Um, which is odd. Um, Altair wore white. I'm guessing that I wear black, and as long as I have this on, I'm wearing black? I don't know. Um, it's kind of odd. Another thing I wanted to do, especially while I'm here, is I wanted to get some of that extra training. Uh, there you are. Want to get in some practice? I would, actually. I, I very much would, especially since I have all this money. Uh, moves. There's a bunch of stuff that we've learned. Uh, archetypes. We've done all that. Then there's special moves. And there's stuff that we can actually unlock. So we have enough money to be able to do all this stuff. We've done the... Apparently we've done the pistol. Um, ranged weapons. Sure. You want to pay for... Tra I do. Let's learn about this... Uh, let's learn about some some ranged weapons. Uh, throw a knife. That guy's dead. Hold when shooting a ranged... Oh, to perform a special attack. Oh, let me log... Let me lock on to the middle dude. And then... Okay, no. Okay. Lock on to this dude, and then special attack. Oh my god! I've learned something new! Woo! Flying knife skill. Continue training, select another tutorial. So that's what you're paying for. You're paying for the ability to learn new moves. That is fantastic. So now we got that down. Um, the pistol thing is a little odd. Why is that in this list? I guess it's just for when you eventually come across the pistol. Long weapons. Yes, let's learn about long weapons. Why is Uncle charging me for this? Alright, sweep attack. So lock on. Hold X to sweep your... Oh, God. To sweep them off their feet. Wow. And then kill them. Sweep! <laughs> kill! I'm gonna sweep! I'm the janitor! And kill! That's fantastic. And that's a lot of fun, too. Oh, my God. These are great. This is what the money's for. I mean, getting all the other stuff is really cool. But learning these special moves is actually really interesting. Two-handed weapons. I want to learn, Cousin Mario. Please teach me your your ways. All right, so smash attack. Oh, so we're playing Smash Brothers. 
Special attack. Let's see if another Ow. Okay, I actually didn't I actually didn't really do it. That was a good one. Okay, special attack. Ugh. Hulk smash. Okay, you can you can stop. We're uh, dude, stop. Stop. We're not fighting. God. <laughs> Take a broken nail. All right, so it takes uh, that takes care of the the special moves free fight. Oh wait, that's just where you free fight. So we did everything. Okay, cool. Um you give me a chance to use this? Is that it? Special attack. Ugh. Special attack. Ow, ow. Special. Stop, 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 stop. Special attack. <laughs> Poor dude. He's like, all right, that's yeah, that was a good session. I'm like, no, I'm going to kill you. Once per hit with the right timing to perform a combo. Yeah, I, I, I've done that before. I got this. Uh, boom. Boom. Oh, God. It's harder with this weapon, I think. Well done. That was good. I got. Am I wanted now? Was I wanted there for a second? I think I was wanted. Uh, no, I'm good. I'm done. I, it was fun. Thank you. I've learned so much, cousin. It's been so useful f to me. Cool. So we know all of the moves, which is great. We know all of the archetypes, and we know now all of the special moves. There's not a special move for the pistol, right? Like with that, the fact because it used to be on here, and it, I think it used to cost like twenty thousand dollars. Um, to reduce the morale of. Oh. See, si. perfetto. Oh, that's I didn't know you could do that. I'm glad I clicked that. You can just hold them at gunpoint and they'll be like, "Oh my God, you have a gun!" Jesus, I just have this sword and we're pretty far yes. away. That would be it's very we take a break. suicidal if I went to attack you. Also, you are not cousin Mario. Sorry, I've been referring to you as cousin Mario, but you are clearly not. That's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. We now have Altair's armor. It's black, which is not what I was expecting. But it's still pretty cool, as long as I don't kill myself in it. Um, next episode, I assume that we'll probably go back to Venice and take care of some stuff there. Um, although I do want to hit up all the viewpoints and stuff in Forley. It looks like there's still a, a good bit to do. It looks like we still have quite a few episodes left. Which is exciting, because I have really enjoyed this game. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for more Steven Plays Assassin's Creed 2. I'm sorry for the loss of your brother. He had it coming. He was bought and paid for by the Borgia. A mistake I have no intention of making. Come, Ezio. We have much to discuss. Did you guys see that beard? Bianca! Bianca! Is everything all right? What do you think? Look at this place. I'm poor Bianca. If something's happened to her... Aha! Oh, my darling. Thank God you're all right. Ezio, meet Bianca. Bianca, Ezio. Charmed.